Hello everyone, welcome to Judas Academy. In this video, we are going to talk about the CLAT PG 2019 notification. The full details of the notification is out. Yes, it's out yesterday and today we are here to talk to you about these full details of the notification. In this video, we are going to talk to you about the pattern, the syllabus, the subjective parts, subjects for the subjective parts, subjects for the objective parts, all those things and there are a lot of other things to talk to you about as well. And in the previous video, we have already talked to you about the contact details and the important dates and the eligibility criteria. If you don't know about those stuff, kindly go and watch that video. The video link is given below in the description. You can check that video as well. So starting with the pattern. And here comes the pattern. In the pattern, you can see the marks is 150. As always, the CLAT PG exam consists of 150 marks and the duration of the CLAT exam. And you know, you have to write this paper within two hours. But here is the catch. In the previous years, you have to write only the objective answer. So the two hours were enough time, ample time to answer all your questions. But this time you have to answer the subjective and the objective. So you have to manage your time carefully because now the 100 marks is for the objective question and 50 marks for the subjective question. Each there will be two subjective questions will be asked and one subjective marks uh, one subjective question will carry 25 marks so 25 into 2 50 marks that is 150 marks total now negative marking you know it already 0.25 that is a negative marking that stays with the objective question this is the general pattern that we have for our CLAT PG exam now talking about the syllabus in the syllabus we can see First, the syllabus for the objective question. The syllabus for the objective question we have is kind of like this, the constitution and the other law subjects. Now you might be asking, sir, where is the jurisprudence? Jurisprudence is not missing. Jurisprudence is now kept under the other law subjects. Uh, so you don't need to worry about the jurisprudence anymore. You might be thinking now, but that's not the case. We'll make make we will be making another video on why you should not look down upon jurisprudence because jurisprudence is certainly a subject you need to study why we'll talk to you another day but now the constitution and the other law subjects constitution will carry 40 marks and other law subjects will carry 60 marks and these other law subjects include ipc jurisprudence contract tort international law and ipr these six subjects each subject, I hope the 10 marks will be divided from the each subjects and total 60 marks will carry. Now, this is the pattern for the objective question. Now, talking about the subjective part, subjective part is very, very important because for the subjective part, we have no mentioning in the CLAT notification. There is no mention of the subjective part. What are the subjects that will be there for the subjective question? So you have to study all the subjects, but we have already made a separate video regarding that. So you can go and check out that video subjects to study for the subjective parts. And we have analyzed in that video, what are the subjects that that were asked in the previous year's question paper and the number of questions, the pattern, the general question pattern that we have already analyzed. If you didn't watch that video, kindly go and watch that video. The video link is also given below in the description and that video will help you what kind of question and what to study for subjective question. But rather than that, you have to study all the subjects like constitution, jurisprudence, IPC, tort, international law, contact and IPR, all the subjects for your subjective question. In the previous video, in in the previous video, we have already talked about the dates that from the 10 January onwards, the online application form filling up is starting, but that's not the case. 13 January onwards, the online application form will be starting. So uh, you have to wait three more days for that. And that is one correction that we needed to make. And that's why we are talking it right now so other than that this is the thing the pattern and the syllabus and the eligibility and all those things we have mentioned in the previous video kindly go and watch that video if you have any doubt regarding that and also if you have any other queries regarding subjective part pattern syllabus all the things kindly mention below in the comment box we will be really happy to help you out regarding the problem you're facing now getting on to the next thing 
is the CLAD PG preparation build-up program. In the previous video, I have already mentioned about the, this preparation build-up program for CLAD PG, particularly for the CLAD PG experience. If you didn't sign up, please go and sign up. This, this will deliver all the analysis of previous years question papers and the tips, tricks, techniques to crack CLAD PG. What would be your technique to crack subjective part and all those things we'll be dealing with you one-to-one -one program will also be there you can contact us through mobile email and all those things so we will answer your queries please go and sign up and also this this program is free of cost there is nothing joining fees there so you can just only enroll it and you will get the benefit of this program the link is given below in the description kindly go and enroll it now the next thing the important thing that i mentioned in the previous video that crash course is live in the julie search portal you can take the crash course now it's a for it's the combination of llm hype course and the psu hype course and it's it's the duration of four or five months it is not the long duration like one year it's the four or five months duration and this in this crash course we will deal you how to write the subjective part and we will improve you your uh, basic writing quality regarding subjective part and uh, also through ai method and other method we will use and we'll make you prepare all the subjective parts and the topics of the subjective part from each subject so looking forward to this course and also the link of this course is given below in the uh, description you can check it out as well so this is it for today if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video with your fellow clad pg aspirants and don't forget to subscribe as well in the channel the clad pg tips tricks and techniques we are sharing with you people if you subscribe you will get the notification first whenever we are going to upload new video and if you have any problem feel free to comment below in the comment box we will definitely contact you there are a lot of queries are coming up we might not be able to contact you uh, within one or two days but we, we will definitely contact you within within seven days so give us the time please so that's why until next time thank you see you soon